It's a Leo. Did you know that one of my favorite fruit is apples? So today we are going to do a word problem about apples. So the word problem is: On day one, there are two hundred fifty-six apples on a tree. On each day after day one. Until one apple is left, the number of apples on the tree is half the number there were the day before. So, on which day there will be only one apple on the tree? So, the choices are shown below. A is ten. B is nine. C is eight. And D is seven. Which one is correct? So now let's figure this out together. We know that on day one there are two hundred fifty-six apples. On day two, the number of apples is half the number of apples on day one. So half of two hundred fifty-six is One hundred twenty-eight. So on day two, there are one hundred twenty-eight apples. Now let's figure out how many apples there are on day three. We know that on day two there are one hundred twenty-eight apples. So the number of apples is half the number of apples on day two. So half of one hundred twenty-eight is sixty-four. So on day three there are sixty-four apples. Now let's figure out how many apples there are on day four. We know that on day three there are sixty-four apples. So the number of apples on day four is half the number of apples on day three. So Half of sixty-four is thirty-two. So on day four, there are thirty-two apples. Now let's figure out how many apples there are on day five. So we know that on day four there are thirty-two apples. So the number of apples is half the number of apples on day four. So half of thirty-two is sixteen. So on day five there are sixteen apples. Now let's figure out how many apples there are on day six. We know that on day five there are sixteen apples. So on day six, number of apples is half the number of apples there is on day five, which is eight. I know this because eight. Plus eight equals sixteen. So on day six, there are eight apples. Now let's figure out how many apples there are on day seven. We know that on day six there are eight apples. So on day seven, it's half the number of apples on day six, which is four, because four plus four equals eight. So on day seven there are four apples. Now let's figure out how many apples there are on day eight. We know that on day seven there are four apples. So on day eight there is half the number of apples on day seven, which is two, because two plus two equals four. So on day eight there are two apples. Now let's figure out how many apples there are on day nine. On day eight, there are two apples. So on day nine, it's half of the number of apples on day eight, which is one, because one plus one equals two. So on day nine, there is one apple. So now let's go back to the question. From what we just said, we know that on day nine there will be 
only one apple on the tree. So the answer is E nine. If you like me, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for your support.